My name is Stephen Watson, I'm Executive Director for PLACE and I'm also Chair of Sefton's Corporate Equalities Group. It takes courage in one's convictions and a confidence in, in the knowledge to do so, but um, I, um, like a lot of people, aim to build the confidence to challenge, um, whether that be um, upwards or downwards or to a colleague, um, where, where there's a need to do so. Um, depending on the circumstance, that might be um, in public or in, or in private, um, but it's having the confidence to, to challenge as and where necessary um, recognising that it's not enough to, to stay silent. It's informally and formally providing the, um, the processes and supporting the structure around an individual, uh, but also um, creating a culture that enables challenge, a safe space to, to call out what, what should be called out as a um, as, as racism or other discriminatory behaviour. The Council's commitment to anti-racism um, must comprise the processes that enable challenge um, and, and action where it's required, uh, but also support the creation of a safe culture that enables uh, challenge, um, including upwards where it's necessary to, to ensure that we continue to learn and improve and create the culture we aspire to um, and to ensure that we retain and attract the diversity of, of talent that we uh, that we aspire to, but underpinning both of those is the um, the training, the education. Um, it's us being a learning organisation to provide the opportunities to continue to learn more about what is racism, what are what are microaggressions, and how can we provide better support for colleagues, uh, for our partners, for our communities in uh, in this regard. Um, and it's ensuring that we have those learning opportunities. Uh, building on the good stuff the council already has, building on the good stuff that the City Region Combined Authority already does to continue to learn more and more to get better and better in this regard and, uh, and deliver against our objectives in this area.